Gender and sexuality are two concepts that are incredibly individualized, and so it shouldn't be surprising that they are so complex. It can be hard to navigate the world of sexuality due to the different terms and labels. This video aims to help you navigate this world by arming you with some definitions and examples of 10 different sexualities, some of which you might not even know about. 1. Bisexuality The definition for bisexuality is actually something that's debated. Originally, the standard definition was attraction to both genders. However, as understanding of gender has evolved, people have argued for an evolved definition of bisexuality. Some use the definition of attraction to your own and other genders to incorporate non-binary genders within its definition. Some famous examples of people who are bisexual are Brandon Yuri from the band Panic at the Disco and actress Angelina Jolie. 2. Homosexuality This is one of the terms that most people tend to be familiar with. It means attraction to one's own gender and is sometimes referred as gay or lesbian. Famous examples include comedian Alan Carr and presenter Sue Peterson. 3. Heterosexuality Heterosexuality is probably the most well-known sexuality, and whether right or wrong, it is often thought of as the default. This is known as heteronormativity. It means attraction to genders other than your own. It's most commonly used to refer to binary genders. 4. Pansexuality Pansexuality is defined as an attraction to all genders. Some say those who are pansexual don't care about gender when it comes to their attraction, though not all agree with this assessment. Some people also use this sexuality and bisexuality interchangeably. Miley Cyrus is a notable person who is pansexual. 5. Polysexuality Polysexuality refers to people who are attracted to two or more genders. Typically, bisexuality and pansexuality are types of polysexuality, though not all people who are polysexual use these terms. 6. Asexuality Asexuality is one of the lesser-known sexualities. It refers to someone who doesn't experience sexual attraction to any gender. This doesn't mean, however, that they never have relationships or sex, which are common myths about asexuality. Bojack Horseman, the TV show, explores asexuality through one of the major characters, Todd Chavez. 7. Gray Asexuality This is similar to the previous sexuality. However, instead of never experiencing sexual attraction, someone who is gray sexual may very rarely experience sexual attraction. They are still valid under the asexuality umbrella, despite occasionally experiencing sexual attraction. 8. Demisexuality Demisexuality, again, can technically fall under the asexual umbrella. People who are demisexual do experience sexual attraction, but only after an emotional connection is created. They wouldn't find a stranger on the street sexually appealing, but after they get to know someone well, the possibility of sexual attraction is there. Demisexuality is considered the halfway point between asexuality and allosexuality, those who experience sexual attraction. 9. Androsexuality Androsexuality is a sexuality that outside of LGBT circles is not well known at all. It refers to someone who is attracted to a masculine gender presentation. This can refer to anyone of any gender, man, woman, or non-binary. 10. Gynosexuality Gynosexuality, like androsexuality, is not well known. It refers to someone who is attracted to a feminine gender presentation. This could again refer to any individual of any gender. We hope you feel more informed about sexuality after watching this video. Which sexuality do you most identify with? Which sexualities were new to you? Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel if you'd like more great content.